and protect us from Glock 19. What's going on with y'all boys, man? Glock 19 back at y'all with another vid. And today I got something that was very highly requested, man. I check all the comments on my videos, and every time I go in my comment section, I see Glock, what's your build? Glock, we need the SIGs, what's your SIGs? What's your dunk packages? What's your jump shot? I'm giving y'all all that in one video. The build, the jump shot, the SIGs, and dunk packages. Let me get a W Glock in the comment section, man. Also, the gameplay you see on the screen right now, this is not just regular clips. These is full gameplay clips, just chopped up so the video not 30 minutes, feel me? But that's enough yapping. I'm gonna be giving y'all the jump shot, SIGs, dunk packages, and build throughout the whole video. So make sure you stay and watch the whole video. And one last thing, last video I asked for 250 likes. Y'all boys got me over 400. Y'all been surpassing my expectations, man. So I'm gonna have to turn it up a little bit. I need y'all to go crazy and give me 1,000 likes on this video a lot of y'all been asking for a full in-depth dribble tutorial so i'm gonna give you all the dribble tutorial but i need at least 1000 likes i know y'all can do it if y'all get a thousand likes on this vid it's not gonna be no regular dribble tutorial i'm gonna make that tutorial like 30 to 40 minutes to make sure y'all can get every dribble move y'all want man and we almost at 5k sub so if you're not subbed up go ahead and leave a sub from me i really appreciate it all right first we're gonna start off with the sigs man the first sig we're gonna be getting into is the dribble style my dribble style is chelsea gray man make sure i put on chelsea gray if you use pro or lebron it's like that but better it got better connectors and it just look cleaner make sure you put on chelsea gray instead of pro or lebron it's the best dribble style if you six six and above next we got the size up i use Giannis size up it's not too many people out here that's really cooking with Giannis size up for real he got the fastest front crossover. Y'all see, y'all be going crazy with that Giannis. Like when I be doing my momentum with the Giannis size up. It just look hella clean to me. That's my favorite size up to use on big guards this year. Next, man, we got the regular breakdown combo. I used Ray for Austin. It was one of the only reasons I wanted to hit starter three this year. It's for that breakdown combo. That shit, it's hella clean. But if you not started three, put on the mellow ball regular breakdown combo. That's the one I was using before I got uh, Ray for Austin unlocked. Next, we got the aggressive breakdown combo. Go ahead and throw in that Devin Booker. Uh, yeah, that's my favorite aggressive breakdown combo right now. That one's super smooth, too. You just walk. It's a nice little walk down. But the thing is, if you not start at three and you can't get that Rayford Austin, you don't need LaMelo Ball regular breakdown and Devin Booker aggressive breakdown because they both just two walk down. So if you not start at three, hit on LaMelo Ball regular breakdown, and then KD aggressive breakdown. That's a nice little combo to have, too. Next, we got the escape, man. I use Jimmy Butler escape. I don't like Kimba Walker. I don't like Trey Young. Both those escapes make your momentum look clunky and just weird. Jimmy Butler got the smoothest momentum. And yeah, man, put on Jimmy Butler escape if you want to have smooth momentums. For my behind the back, I use Kobe. It's like the glitches behind the back. And it got a nice standard behind the back. But if you don't like Kobe before I use Kobe, I used to use Tyrese Halliburton. His is nice too. Or if you 6'8, uh, use Jamal Murray. Next, we got the spin. This right here is the real Pro 4 spin. Not Kawhi Leonard, not Penny Hardaway, not Jamal Murray. DeMar DeRozan is the real Pro 4 spin. All the other ones got the Pro 4 spin animations. But you get the best half spin with DeMar DeRozan. If you don't know, now you know. Next, we got the hesitation. The hesitation I use is Tyrese Halliburton. It's the best one for me. It like really catch people off guard because it make it look like you're running, and you could just snatch the other way when you do your little hezzy. I probably think I'm gonna do right. Yep, there you go, right there. I just did it. But that's how the uh, hezzy look. Make sure I throw that on if you wanna, you know, fry niggas, catch niggas off guard. And for the step back, I use Jimmy Butler step back. That's the only step back I actually like on this game. That's just me though. If you never tried it, go ahead, try Jimmy Butler out. See if you mess with it. For my combo moves, I use pro combo moves. Uh, this is the one I really mess with on all my builds. It's some other good ones too, but this is just the one I like the most. Uh, for my crossover, I got on Kobe crossover. That's how you gonna get that push cross animation. Uh, if you can't get Kobe pit on John Wall, they're pretty much the same crossover. All right, this is what a lot of y'all boys been waiting for. Y'all been asking me for my build, man. So I got y'all. This, trust me, this is the best build I've used the whole year. It's my favorite build. It can literally do everything. 
everything there's only one thing i would change about this build and it's probably not what you're thinking the only thing i would change about this build right here is that i accidentally made it left-handed i like right hand builds but i accidentally made this build left-handed but it's not that big of a deal other than that let's get straight into it it's how you gonna make the build 6'6 six, six point guard lowest weight max wingspan look just take a look at the build bro take a look at the build we can go into some detail though driving dunk 96 driving dunk do i gotta say too much more you get all the elite contact dunks and you dunk everything bro you dunk everything this build i used to average like two to three contact dunks per game bro people be on the court they be like bro why is he rim running you think i got a 96 build not to dunk the ball crazy let's get into this shooting though this build i rarely ever miss on this build i got the best jump shot on this game but for the mid-range you're going to go 87 that's going to get you t-mac base which is very important on 6-6 builds if you don't like t-mac base you also get bases like jr smith scotty pippen stuff like that but t-mac is the best base in the game everybody know that 83 that's all you need even if it was like a 78 you still good as long as you got the badges that 87 midi it's gonna get you t-mac base and you get badges like mini magician gold open looks gold guard up gold green machine dead eye blinders like you get great badges and trust me bro 80 is good you're not gonna miss if you know how to shoot i barely ever miss whether it's open it can be a little bit contested like five percent i'm still greening shooting over those with this jump shot bro trust me i got the best jump shot playmaking you're gonna want to go 93 ball handle 83 speed i like i see pump, some people pit like 75 pass sack on their builds you don't really need that bro you don't need no like crazy pass like animations unless you like to play fives a lot then you're going to be build with like a lot of pass sack but i'll play twos and a little bit of threes sometimes but mostly twos and my passes always get there quick like regular passes you know uh 83 speed with ball that's gonna get you speed booster on go so you need that that's all you need uh six, 66 interior i only put it to 66 i had it like 60 but i had nothing else to put it on so i threw it on 66 75 perimeter and 80 block i know some y'all might be thinking like bro is this defense good enough for me to get stops can i play defense with 75 66 and no steal yes 100 percent. trust me i've been playing this game and I, I never have a problem getting stops on defense. I got chased down, so I'm always getting contested at the rim. And I got 66 interior with max wing spin, so I'm always getting contested at the rim. And on the perimeter, the build is fast. So, and with max wing spin, you get bump animations. Clamps is a fraud this year. You don't need clamps, it barely does anything. If you know how to play defense, you good. You can guard anybody except post scores. Speed 86, what you need for speed booster, so pit that to 86, 73 excel, what you need for silver blow by, essential badge, uh, 53 strength, my bad, 51 strength, and then 86 vert, 99 stem, 86 vert, that's gonna get you your one foot elite contact dunks, so if you go to 96 dunk, you're going to also pit 86 vert, so you get all the good, you know, the extra contact dunk animations, and 86 vert gonna help a lot with your chase downs and when you're in the paint. When you jump, you jump high as hell to like stop bigs or anybody going in the paint. But yeah, man, that's my build. The best build I use this whole year. I don't think I'll make another guard build except when I make my new 6'4. I ain't upgraded my 6'4 yet, but when I do get, make that build, I'm gonna drop some content on it. Let me know if y'all want that 6'4 build, but this is the best 6'6 build on this game, hands down, for my playstyle. Alright. Alright, y'all. Next, we're gonna get into the jump shot. Not gonna lie, this is the best jump shot I have ever used this whole year. It's my favorite jumper, bro. You shoot over people, it's fast, it's easy to time. Like, this is the best jumper, bro. Pick this jumper on if you can get it. So, the jumper is Tracy McGrady Bass, Troy Brown Jr., and Sadiq Bay. You see how you get A plus speed and A plus height, and you get good time and stability? Like, this jump shot is crazy. It's the best jump shot I've used this whole year. Troy Brown Jr., Sadiq Bay, T-Mac. Pit that on. You're going to shoot lights out, bro, I swear. And, like, the animation. I play on set point. When you release the ball, it's, like, soon as it gets, like, to the top of your head type shit. 
All right, y'all, here go my dunk packages. If you really want to get on that rim, go crazy. I get all the elite contact dunks, so off one and two. I got all the contact dunks on. And then I don't use no other uh, two foot dunks for real. But for the one foot, I got on straight arm tomahawks. Then I got on double clutches. The, I mean, uh, side clutches off one. These right here. These really get you on that rim. It's the best two hand dunk in my opinion. And he just like, he dunked that shit with like force. Like he really dunked the ball. You see that? And then for like signatures, I use Russell Westbrook. That's it. So Russell Westbrook. Michael Jordan, you gotta be starter three for that. If you're not starter three, sorry. But yeah, Russell Westbrook, Michael Jordan, and then uh, straight arm tomahawks and side clutches off one. Then it's your key dunk packages right there. And then for oops, it's just preference. You don't really need like any certain alley oops or nothing like that. All right, y'all, that's gonna wrap it up for the video. If you stayed to the end, I really appreciate y'all boys, man. And if you're new, make sure you drop a sub for me, man. I really appreciate it, and it's completely free to subscribe, bro. Don't be bougie with your subscribe button, bro. It's free. Also, if y'all want that dribble tutorial, make sure y'all try to get me to a 1,000 likes on this vid. Even if y'all don't get there, if y'all get close, I'm going to still drop that dribble tutorial for y'all, man. But yeah, let me know in the comments any other content y'all want to see from me or if there's anything I miss in the vid that I can put in the next vid. And I got y'all, man.